Hi my name is Aisha and I am a hacker. Today I am going to show you how to install and run Beef. Beef hooks web browsers, just from opening the web page, the attacker gets control of the victim's computer. Beef can work against browsers on Windows, Linux, and OS X. Kali Linux has Beef pre-installed if you are running Kali, you should be able to start and stop Beef from your applications menu. The application menu is my preferred method. If Beef is pre-installed, skip the install progress. Let's start by installing Beef for those that don't have it pre-installed. I believe on the Beef GitHub page there is instructions to install Beef on other platforms. But we will be talking about Linux. First go to the Beef GitHub page https colon slash slash github.com slash beef project slash beef, get the link and clone beef in your terminal by using git clone https colon slash slash github.com slash beef project slash beef dot git. Once you have the beef directory, go to the directory and enter ls. You will now see the files in the directory. Next enter, slash install beef will now install. Next to run beef enter, slash beef or use beef start from the applications menu. Beef requires .NET to be installed to work, so if you're not working with the Kali pre-installed beef, you would also need to install .NET to Kali. Once beef is running in your terminal, you will need to log into beef. Beef will normally open the browser when it finishes loading. Once beef connects to the browser, let us begin. Now log in. The default username and password is beef. If for any reason it won't log in edit the config, I'm a file and set a password. Once logged in, you will be on the getting started tab. You will notice there are a couple of options to hook your own browser. Do that. You will now see a web page open. This has captured your own browser. Your machine is now captured. You can now click on the hooked browser and then go to commands tab. As you can see there is a huge choice. We will try the Google phishing attack. This will turn your beef test page into a Google login page. A good tip before sending the URL to the victim is to use short URL or a site like that to make the URL less suspicious. I suspect this may not work as well as hoped on modern updated browsers, but there's a lot of older computers without updated software out there and that is why this tool is still formidable if used even today. If you have an old PC, give it a try. It should be noted that you should not do this to anyone without their permission as it could cause legal problems. Remember kids, hacking is illegal, so if you ever get caught, you never heard of me. Thank <laughs> you.